Hello everyone, thank you so much for joining me on my YouTube channel today. I hope you're all doing well and I hope you're going to help me by watching this video to celebrate Soleil's birthday. Uh, Soleil here on YouTube is doing a wonderfully kind thing and running a little birthday giveaway. Wanted to give a shout out because I've watched quite a few of her videos. I'm still quite new to her channel but she makes some fantastic YouTube videos. She loves making bright colourful projects handmade embellishments which are just absolutely beautiful so yeah please go and check out Soleil's channel if you've not been by I'll link it in the description box below and please hit her subscribe button like I say she's doing such a kind thing of running a little birthday giveaway so she's having the hashtag Soleil 46 B day and the rules for her giveaway is she would like you to make a birthday card it's either got to have her name or 46 as the um, little embellishment on the card it can be any theme you like any colour you like um, obviously she'd like you to use the hashtag Soleil46B day uh, she'd like you to email her address after you have posted your project and you can post it either on youtube or instagram she'd just like you to email your address to her so it's easier if you are her lucky winner and the closing date is the 22nd of february so you've got lots of time still to enter like i say i will link Soleil's channel in the description box below hope this is something you might like to go and join in with lovely thing for Soleil to do and such a fun little challenge so for my card design for Soleil I thought I'd make a nice vintage feel card as yeah I've not made a vintage style card for a while now and it was just fun to have a look through all my little vintage ephemera pieces and put this de design together so what I've got is a 6x6 card blank and then I've matted a piece of this lovely um, text vintage style writing backing paper right at the back of my card as you can see and then on top of that I've matted a piece of this vintage style paper that's all sort of already distressed it's got beautiful little uh, fruits on it and leaves and it really gives you that sort of vintage vibe um so I've matted that on top, added a bit of ink around the edge. Then, like I say, I went through my ephemera pieces and found all these beautiful vintage-style bird-themed items. So what I've done is die-cut a craft card circle, matted this piece of bird cage paper on top, and then fussy-cutted round the bird so it looked like the bird is sitting on the side of the cage. Again, ink round the edge of that. And then on the papers I had, it had this these beautiful little images here that I thought looked like book pages so I've ripped and torn the edges inked the edges with some more ink and yeah just think that tied in beautifully with the backing papers then I've used some sentiments that I found that say what a little birdie said sing sweet bird and then I stamped the sentiment wishing you a fabulous birthday and then added a little 46 down on this little page here because I thought it'd make it look a bit like a playing card having the number what Soleil wanted us to add so yeah that is my little design really like how it's all come together and just to give it that finishing touch I've used these sort of pewter colour brads in the corners just to tie in with those greys and browns of the design and yeah really hope Soleil likes the little birthday card that I have made for her I really enjoyed making it like I say I haven't done a vintage card for a little while so it was lovely to get all those browns and creams together on a project so yeah please go and check out Soleil's channel like I say I'll link it in the description box below let me know what you think of my card have you been doing much vintage crafting um it seems to be going a little bit out of style now in crafting but i know it has certainly come back because like with everything these trends go round in circles don't they but i really enjoy doing my vintage card hope it inspire you to maybe have a look through some of your vintage ephemera and your papers and maybe you might like to go down the vintage route for your card design so like i say thanks so much for watching today look forward to reading all of your comments please hit that like button if you have liked this video and subscribe if you're new and i hope to see you all again soon bye for now mm -hmm.